Hey, what up everyone? Today I'm gonna show you uh, the Yatur Digital Music Exchanger. Uh, I'm gonna uh, show you where's where the content uh, of this little thing, uh, what we can find inside. Uh, but quick few words, what it is. Uh, this is the uh, Digital Music Exchanger, so if you don't have the USB port in your radio or your radio doesn't play MP3s or something, uh, and you would like to uh, use MP3s, uh, and for example, from the uh, USB pen drive or uh, whatever, you can use your phone uh, just via a jack cable. Uh, you could connect this uh, and just use uh, your favorite music tracks in your car without having changing uh, the the stock radio. So, uh, what we've got here. Uh, is uh, I bought the, the kit for the Audi A3 uh, 2003 uh, so you have the code over here you can see that that's the type that, it, that you need uh, what's inside quick look oh, we got some warranty cars uh, we've got additional uh, things that you, you, can, you, can, you may need to uh, take out the radio uh, yeah, that's how it looks. Accessories. Uh, besides that, we've got the, the other changer. That's pretty small. So, if you could like, if you would like to compare it, there's the lighter. So, that's about a uh, this big. So, uh, we've got this. Uh, we also have some connectors and uh, adapters. Uh, of course, user's manual. Uh, well, that shouldn't be here as a stock uh, thing. I bought it as a, an additional one, but uh, I'm gonna tell you about it just in a second. Uh, there, all the rest is stock, so you have uh, cables to connect uh, the other CD changer uh, to your radio. It, that's supposed to work uh, without anything else, and you have jack to jack standard cable, so you can connect your phone uh, just by the headphone jack. Uh, so, uh, as I said, this one should be enough to connect everything, but sometimes, uh, in some cases, you would need a 20 pin adapter. I don't know uh, if it's gonna work in my car just with this, the 8 pin, uh, but uh, I bought it just in case uh, the additional cable and just to uh, connect it to the adapter and then just connected to the radio so uh, tomorrow I'm going to the uh, to the garage so I'm gonna uh, connect it I'm gonna try to make a quick real quick tutorial because it's really easy to install it so uh, I'm gonna try to make a real quick tutorial for you so you would be able to do it yourself you don't need to go to any mechanics or uh, I mean workshops or, or anything like that so uh, that's how it looks that's the the outer CD changer digital stuff you have the uh, over here we got the USB over here uh, we have the thing that you connect the cable to it as you can see you got the same stuff to connect it and also uh, there is a SD card slot let me see well, it should be somewhere here Let's unpack it real quick. Uh, yeah, so that's the standard connections. You got the LED over here, so I guess it's supposed to be uh, like the indicator if it works or doesn't. You have the Bluetooth uh, uh, connection connector over here, so if you buy the additional uh, Bluetooth module, you could use just your Bluetooth. Over here, we've got the SD, HDHT, and MMC card. Uh, you have the AUX of course for the cable with jack and you got the USB port so that's it nothing else besides that uh, as I said I'm gonna try to show you tomorrow uh, how to install it yourself so stay put and have a nice day